This is Don Howe, and the topic for this golden nugget is jargon, and this is part one of two. The word jargon is a noun which refers to special words or expressions that are used by a particular profession or group and are difficult for others to understand. We've all probably used jargon at some point in our lives. When I was growing up, the kids in my neighborhood and at school had their own jargon. After high school, my draft number was three and it was during the Vietnam War. So I joined the Air Force. In the Air Force, I learned a whole new way of talking, especially when I was stationed at RAF Chicksands in England. The next golden nugget is all about the jargon that we used at Chicksands, jargon that helped to mold us into a team. We knew what was being communicated, but outsiders didn't, and it took time for the new people to sort of fit in. Yes, using jargon can be like speaking a different language and it can knit people together, but it can also alienate people. I work with a lot of insurance salespeople and they talk about how much AP they wrote last week while they were in the field. I go to church and sometimes church people use words like lost and saved and hedge of protection, words and phrases that don't make a lot of sense to non-church goers. And oh, here's another example of jargon. I recently played basketball with three inner city youth and I didn't understand what they were saying. They were speaking English and I understood most of the words, but I still didn't understand what they meant. But at least I now know that when someone says the word dope, they aren't necessarily talking about somebody who's not bright or even an illegal drug. They might be talking about something that was really cool or great, something that they really liked. I've got to tell you, this type of slang can make me feel like I'm getting old. And the next golden nugget sort of reinforces the fact that I might be getting a little bit older because it's been more than 40 years since I was in England when I was in the Air Force. So with all of this in mind, let me wrap up this golden nugget by reminding you that if you belong to a group that has its own jargon. Enjoy the camaraderie, but be sensitive to those who are outside of your group. Of course, I expect that you are sensitive to others because that's how winners behave. And you are a winner. And given enough time, you will win. Yes, you are a winner. Thank you for listening to this golden nugget by Don Howe. To learn more about Don's free sales success system or to have a free success audio like this one sent to you each weekday, please visit DonHowSuccess.com. That's D-O-N-H-O-W-E-S-U-C-C-E-S-S dot -E 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 com.